In this video, we will complete the digital SAT in five minutes. Time starts now. All right, guys, so 10% of 470 is 47. Uh, same switch is given equation. So 4x is equal to 12. Subtract 6. Okay, so service fee $25. Who knows plus 25? Guess why? Intercept. So gone, gone, gone. 3 is D. Uh, which the function g is defined by g of x equals 9 plus 9 for which value of x and g equal 25. All right, so what is x equal? x must be 4, right? Because 4 squared 16 plus 9 is uh, 25. Four side then with a different number of 15. The dice roll one time was probably rolling a 2. Well, that's one out of 14, because only one, two on the dice. Your printer produces posters at a constant rate of 40 posters per minute. At what rate of per hour does the printer produce a poster? All right, so you do 42 times 60, because 60 minutes an hour. So I'll use my calculator right here, 42. Oh, it means a computer, guys, by the way. 42 times 60 is 2,520. All right, cool. What is, a, is that it? Yeah, that's easy. All right, so number seven, what the function? Uh, S equals 4, so 7 times 4 is 28, plus 2 is 30. That's right. Create a sign with 40 points. X is the number of 1 point questions, so that's X, and Y represents the number of 3 point questions, so 3Y. So you need 3Y. No 3Y, no 3Y, no 3Y. Okay. So similar triangles have corresponding angles. Angle M has, so angle M is the middle one, so angle Q is the middle one. Angle M has measured 53 degrees. What is measured angle Q? This should be 53 as well, because similar triangles, so they have the same angle. So angle M is congruent to angle Q. What is the value of X? What I can do is Y equals negative three X. In this case, I'm actually just gonna solve for X. So you have X equals 15. Um, that would be easy. Cause you just plug in negative three X to here. So you get X equals 15. Is the most appropriate linear model for the dash on the scatter plot? All right, so we know it's descending. So it has to be negative slope, that's wrong. And it's a positive Y intercept. So right there. Let's go even faster. All right, so number 12. How many values? I think it's zero, one, two, three. Don't read the whole thing. Coming for each package party hat costs three dollars. Each cupcake costs one dollar. Ten packages of party hats, so that's thirty dollars. The party hats, same amount, thirty is forty-one. Uh, okay, just factor. This is what twelve z and minus two z. So one value would be uh, two. Bacteria. According to the three hundred times doubles every three hours. So then six hundred k. Then add uh, six hours is one twelve. That that nine hours it's like yes. Yeah, so this would be the highest one at this point. So this works up oh, right here. Oh, the first one I looked at. I made a boo boo. You got to add these together so it's actually this one. Let's see, all right. Um, X so X is right here. Two questions. Hector Park. Hector Park area. Okay, so this has to be negative slope, so let's say let's say negative eight x or whatever. So this can't wait, this could be it. Oops, this that's this could be it, this can't be it. Could 12 y double four a d is forty, so y is forty, y is forty, negative slope. Alright, good. A radius is pi r squared, so that's three pi squared times pi. Oh shit, radius is one twenty nine. Oh buddy, it's one twenty nine squared, some super high number. How many times that's the highest number in that case. Other ones don't make sense. Summarize, where's the maximum data value data set? Uh, this appears 11 times. Oh wait, it doesn't matter. The maximum value is 14. It's not about which one is printing the most time. What is the value of R? So two, four, two, nine is the middle, and then two, 14. So what is the rate? What is the radius basically is asking? Radius is five. Five away, five away. What is the measure of angle T in degrees? It's greater than this. So 2 pi over 3 plus 5 pi over 12. So this is equal to 8 pi over 12. So that's 13 pi over 12 times 180 over pi. So 13 over 12 times 180. That's 15. 13 times 15. What's 13 times 15, guys? Boom, 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 boom. 195. What is the area in square yards of this town? I have to use a calculator for this one. I have no idea how much time I have left, but let's keep going. All right, so 24. Um, to the slope is 30 over five, which is six x. So let's plug in so y equals six x plus b. So let's say 130 is equal to six times 18 plus b. So that's 108, uh, 130 minus 108 is 22. So six x plus 22, five units. So six x plus 17 equals y equals whatever. Uh, so right here. All right, okay, so actually, 
this is this what negative 100 right here this opens downwards right so it can't cost here once that's wrong uh negative 4 e1 divided by 4 or something above 100 so that's wrong too it has to be under 100. 9 or 2 is way too little see process elimination okay so we look at this um scale the equations we got same exact equation type 15y plus 35 multiple both sides by 5. so always try a or b in these cases um let's try b first so we put this into here we get negative 3r plus 7 plus 3r equals 7. So track 3r from both sides the same exact equation on both sides we got negative 3r plus 7 it equals negative 3r plus 7 oh my god i'm rushing uh triangle okay uh six so equal arrows so that's 2a8 2a8 the height is k squared root 3 okay it's fine k so this you know this is 104 we'll put by 2 so that's 2a8 squared minus 104 squared equals k square root 3 squared so basically we're doing square root of 32,448 divided by square root 3 equals k and that is 104 oh shit k equals 104 probably a faster way to do that but that's what i got and that's completing the digital SAT in hopefully five minutes. If you guys have any questions and you guys want to learn the same tricks and patterns that I use for this, be sure to check out my course in the description below. Um, and yeah, hope you guys do a great job. Peace.